Chapter 5, Legend. Whoa. Why do I feel like they've already died? Wait, who did die? What? I need a vacation. I don't... I don't... I don't get it, but okay. Something's going on here. In time to rest, the situation is critical. Zero lifer? Yes. The hell are those assholes after now? Oh, that's Jack over here. Oh, he's got the robot arm still. Genocide. What? It can't be possible. Stop worshipping that terrorist. They are spazzing out over here. They made it clear in their demands. Federation must abolish alien slavery. They will unleash the virus across the entirety of Gactus 7, whatever that is. Ah, they explain what it is. It's one of the planets with the highest rate of slaves over humans. What do, do they want to do? Free them by killing them? Not at all. They're after the virus has... It only affects mammals. It will create a free world for aliens with a planet uninhabitable for humans. Oh, this should be easy then. Destroy their mothership. Problem solved. Those demands were made a week ago. Federation refuses to negotiate with terrorists. And the virus became airborne 37 hours ago. There's no need to panic. I know the cure. We can produce an antidote now. It's not that easy. They mutated it. Xeno Medusa. They, only they have the antidote. How many people are at risk? Four billion. That's great. This is fantastic. They're still open. Federation accepts their demands. They will launch the antidote into the atmosphere. They won't accept. Federation never negotiates. For them, it's just another piece on their board. They even use the tragedy as propaganda. So that's it. We aren't superhuman. There's nothing else we can do. We should get some rest and focus on how to stop them in the future. No. I'll go. I'm gonna stop them. You are insane. Let me go with you. I got my super armor on now. Not this time. This is a one-man mission. This is suicide. You should have gotten used to suicide missions by now, Jack. I'm finishing the calculations now. You should collide with their mothership in two hours and 29 minutes. I don't have exact data on the integrity of the Matriarch's hull, but you have approximately a 32% chance of surviving the crash. Are you sure you still want to proceed? 32%. That's a gift from the gods in the face of saving 4 billion lives. So let me get this straight. You're gonna fire yourself- yeah, it's like Star Trek. You're gonna fire yourself out into space, piloting a one-man cruiser headed toward the Matriarch, aiming directly at the core labs of the ship. Retrieve the antidote, and then manually fire it into the atmosphere. Exactly. And you're saying this isn't a suicide mission? Yes. What about being inside a collapsing spaceship surrounded by enemy forces? I'll figure it out. Thank you for everything. We owe you our lives. For all the pain, suffering, and success, it's been an honor. Woof. Okay, Brandon, say goodbye to everybody. You're going with the sergeant. My AI module will allow me to commandeer the droid rocket, allowing me to disperse the, the antidote's reactive agents over the planet's atmosphere. That means I won't come back, 100% sure. I'm so glad I could be of service until the end. Goodbye, everybody. Okay, you're ready to go. While Brent is connected to your spacesuit, he can provide useful intel during the mission. At this point, you should at least feel sorry for doubting him all those months ago. You are a rancorous nerd. He's trying to come back alive to honor his heroic sacrifice. Yeah, whatever, sure. Go kick some ass. Yes, Predator! Predator! Handshake, let's go.
Are you seeing this? Outer space. An endless sea of scattered dust in a vast veil of darkness. I don't know why, but this cold void feels like home. It's hard not to feel completely insignificant in the face of all this darkness. So it's not like Star Trek, because he's, he's in a ship. Whatever. Have you ever considered your purpose, Brandon? What it means to exist? Out here, it makes you wonder what four billion lives really mean. Just another white dot. One of a million pinpricks of light, each one indifferent to its inhabitants. Millions of points of light, so far in the future they have already died. Why did I spend my whole life protecting them? What am I protecting, exactly? I spent my whole life fighting and I don't even know why. In fact, I can't remember anything beyond fighting. I never had a home. We aren't so different to you and I, Brandon. You and I are the same. I too have never known childhood. It's like I've only existed, existed to save the world again and again. Not for duty, respect for life, or any human values. I'm like Marvin, just can't stop chasing after that damn stick. This cause is the only thing that's ever felt true. Good god, how long is this speech? I'm getting tired of speaking all heroically. And as long as the gods keep tossing that stick, I'll keep bringing it back. This meaningless world. Oh hey, it's, it's the game over screen. Well, one option. Um... East. North. Let's follow the wall. Oh, hello. Identify yourself. What is this place? Are you wearing an er Everdusk spacesuit? Yeah, the nebula. I had an accident. I don't know, sir. You're on the desert planet of Legion in the middle of a war. We fight for the Federation, of course. I see. How can I help? You just survived what should have been a fatal orbital shipwreck, and you're telling me you're ready for action. I heard Everdusk was full of puny nerds. By the gods, was I wrong. Is there a point to all this? Your insignia denotes sergeant, so technically you're in command. And frankly, if your space spacesuit's transceiver still works, you could save us all. Save you how? This is embarrassing, but our platoon got lost in the desert, and the rendezvous deadline is... 152 hours. Okay, let's join your platoon and hurry our way back. Yes, sir. What is your name? Can't remember. Just call me a sergeant for now. Who's this? I found him while I was exploring the area. He's a sergeant with Everdusk. Miraculously, he survived an air-to-surface orbital shipwreck. He's offered his help, and the fact is, we can make good use of his spacesuit's transceiver. It's still functional. Is that true? Just point me in a direction, I'll do my best to lead you there. This might be a sign of the gods. I thought we were damned this place already. I'm Sergeant Abraham. It'll be a pleasure to follow your lead. Just Sergeant. Very, very well. To where, then? We know our base camp is southwest from here, but this desert is treacherous. That could be a problem. The only time the desert's no darkness are when the sandstorms block the sun. Excuse me? There is no night. The two suns keep this planet as deserted as, as it can get. Corporal was born here. Children are tough. Be wise to listen to his advice. Didn't I leave you behind? What? Our best option is to use as little water as possible. We should only drink when our bodies are crying for it. Sleeping under the sun is suicide. If we want to rest, we'll have to look for shelters behind cool shadows. And there's also the fact that we're currently engaged in a full-fledged retreat from a war we cannot win. We should watch out for re rebel patrols and enemy camps. That's where our scouts can explore the terrain ahead for us. The time is of the essence. And what about your leg? They took it away. 
Desert Sands making it look ugly. If you feel you need to make any sacrifices, I'll give you authority to do so, starting with me. What the hell? We don't even know this guy. Show up, Inspector, Commanding Officer. We're marooned. We're still gonna follow a chain of command. Count on me. This desert won't forgive any missteps. Friendships won't save anyone out here. So man up and let's go. Perfect stamina. Alright, everyone's good. I have no idea what's going on. Not going anywhere yet. Get some water from this cactus here. Let's scavenge. Thank you. 
enemy patrol. Send attack. Flawless attack. Good job, team. Is there like a rest option? I have no idea where I'm going. I mean, we made it. Shit. Well, that sucks. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been Gods Have Been Watching. I have no idea what's going on. I'm in this random desert somewhere. Stay tuned for more. I don't know how much longer I have in the game. But we will have to find out. See you guys next time.